Alrighty, so back home here in Colorado. Of course, I love the adventure, the thrill of the hunt, all that fun stuff, but the end game for hunting for me is organic meat to feed the family. We love it. Let's make a pizza with white-tailed deer sausage. I have the Blackstone Pro Series griddle heated up, a little bit of olive oil, and down with my Italian white-tailed deer sausage. It's semi-frozen. I've had it out of the freezer for a couple of hours. The sausage is looking good. Of course, we make our own Italian deer sausage. It's 75% venison deer meat with 25 percent pork shoulder i didn't include any of the processing in this video but you can go back and watch my uh south dakota deer hunting video and we talk a little bit more about it there and of course we add italian spices thyme oregano basil red pepper garlic etc so our ground italian sausage is done we're going to go ahead and pull it I have my pizza dough here, and for the first time ever, I'm trying out Delalo's Italian Pizza Dough Kit. Of course, I love their sauce. Been using it for years. It's from Pennsylvania. Of course, I'm originally from Pennsylvania, so we're gonna go down with some of our pizzeria-style Delalo pizza sauce. This is good stuff. I actually used it in the live stream earlier today. I have some fresh basil here. Gonna rip that off and just throw it down there in my sauce. You can make a pizza any way you want to, friends. So uh, we never make the same pizza twice around here. So a little bit of basil, and then I'm gonna go down with uh, shredded mozzarella. So a little bit of shredded mozzarella on my pizza. And then I found these nice little cloves of roasted garlic over at the grocery store, over at the deli here. So. Uh, Roasted garlic. Last but not least, my freshly griddled <laughs> whitetail Italian deer sausage. And I'll go ahead and even sprinkle a little extra cheese on top just to kind of hold everything together. I've got my brand new Blackstone pizza oven here. You can get these at blackstoneproducts.com. Doing a stone temperature, about 750 degrees. I put some semolina flour down on my pizza peel here to allow that crust to just roll off like ball bearings. We're gonna throw it straight in there on the pizza stone. This should take about 90 seconds to two minutes to cook up. It's been about a minute. I'm gonna check my crust. It's starting to get some nice color, but it's not burned yet. Can you see that? I think it looks perfect. I think our pizza is just about perfect there. Take a look at that. That is a delicious homemade pizza with fresh dough and Italian whitetail deer sausage. I'm a pizza cutter kind of guy, but Blackstone has this brand new pizza rocker, so let's go ahead and try that today. Look at that, that's the way I like my pizza to look. It's nice and pliable. It has a nice colored crust, accents of black and brown and yellow, but it's not burned. Let's give it a try. Pizza is absolutely perfect. That's just the way I want mine to look. Hopefully you can see that crust in the sun there. Beautiful. We had a person on my live stream last week that asked if we could get a leopard crust on the pizza. I admit I'm not an expert. I'm assuming that's what they mean by a leopard crust and I think the answer is yes. So a beautiful, beautiful pizza. Fresh dough, definitely the way to go. Again, Blackstone Pizza Oven, not only for pizza though, you're gonna see us cooking everything from skillet cookies in there to uh, strombolis and calzones, cedar plank salmon, probably some types of uh, pasta dishes, shrimp scampi and 
other things. You just let your imagination run wild. So hopefully you enjoyed this video, my deer hunting adventure in Nebraska. We didn't focus a lot on the processing in this video like we did in the previous one. And then of course, why we do it here at the end. So thanks for watching. This is Todd. This is Let's Give It A Try. Until next time, praise the Lord and pass the pizza with the white tail deer Italian sausage. <laughs>